target locked. Welcome to a challenge, it's called Best of the Rest. It's a brand new series with an ultimate test. You take the only player in the game that rep in his nation. You drop a mini squad and take him to the top of the table. Welcome to Burundi. The second smallest country in Africa, known for its incredible coffee and tea, is also the birth nation for the 28-year-old striker. I guess we could call him Lionel and Missy? Well, something boys and welcome to best of the rest episode number seven featuring the only player from Burundi like I said the second smallest nation in Africa and one of the least urbanized uh, nations in the world 10.9 percent of their population living within cities in the country Cedric Amissi has one of the most barren Wikipedia pages possible 28 years old has played for Altaun uh, and plays for Altaun in the Dari Jamil League um, and then outside of that there's really nothing too notable about him probably the plainest 64 rated maybe the most plain card that we've used so far three star weak foot two star skill moves as you guys can see here 65 finishing he's got some shot power he's got some long shots and as you guys have seen across the epis of best of the rest some of these bronze and silver players have actually stepped up well just bronze players because we haven't used any silvers yet have stepped up in a big big way but best of the rest is back like i said episodia number i believe seven if you guys have been enjoying the series smash that like button we've been crushing about 2,000 likes on every epi so if you guys want to see another one very very quickly make sure to hit that like button it is massively appreciated as well if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below now we, he's in the Dariel Jamil League, so you knew we had to put together a squad featuring Al Suma, Omar Al Suma, his 86 rated card. We've got the five star skiller, the Brazilian Elton. We've got ourselves Atif and then Amrit, uh, Amrabat, one of the stars for Morocco at the World Cup. And on the other side, we've got Al Gamdi. We've got Al Baraik, uh, Fulata, or Falata, whatever his name is, is extinct. And then the Spanish, the just oddly Spanish duo of Alexis and Botia. We've got one of the oldest players, well, the oldest player that was at the World Cup in the form of El Hadari, I believe. He's like 40 years old. And then Al Harbi, the team of the season flavored. There was a, believe a Peruvian or Chilean player, Ca Carlos Villanueva. Uh, he's currently extinct. I wanted to use him as Cam. And then also there was another Leonardo who's going for about 80,000 coins. Uh, is also extinct. So we were not able to use the combo of those two. Would have been really, really nice to be able to. But uh, we are going to have to make do with this. We're going to apply a manager item. And uh, it is, what league is it? It is, you guys don't know how best of the rest works. We look at the entire globe and find a player that is the only one in ultimate team that represents their nation. And then we use them in a squad, play two matches. A goal is three points, man of the match is two points. Uh, an assist is one, a win is one. And then um, I'm pretty sure that is it. We're gonna counter rage quit is two. So like I said, three goals, uh, three points for a goal. Uh, one, uh, two points for main of the match, one goal, one point for a win, one point for an assist, and then two for a rage quit. But without any further ado, boys, we've got ourselves the Saudi squad. Again, nothing too crazy about Burundi. The only cool fact that I could find about Burundi, his mother uh, is actually English, but was born in Burundi. So technically, and I did look this up, it looks like it's legit. Technically, Kevin De Bruyne, KDB, could play for Burundi if he chose to. Griffin FC, aka Broke FC, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure this is a sub, if I am not mistaken. Griffin FC and that Shamrock badge. Hold on, let's see. What squad does he have? Let's see if it looks familiar. Chicharito. So he's got Chicha in there, uh, which doesn't exactly mean that he's a fan, but it looks very familiar. Broke FC. I would not be surprised if someone popped on the mic just now. I've got my uh, I've got my Astro headset right here. I wish you guys could hear it. I wish I had the technology. I wish I had the, I wish I had the ability to make this, but there's something wrong with the Xbox that doesn't let it play through. So I'm gonna have to fix, uh, I'm gonna have to figure out that audio issue. I'm gonna have to figure out that audio issue, but what do you want to bet that a guy pops up on the mic right now? How short is Elton? Ooh, okay, we gotta get a little bit more. We gotta get a. We gotta get a little bit more compact. Chicharito makes it one nil. As it stands, we have zero points. We have zero points with Burundi. Speaking of Burundi and Kevin. De Bruyne, aka Kevin De Burundi. I think that's his new nickname. KDB. Um, he's injured, I think. Was it? It was announced a couple days ago that he he tore some like cruciate ligament. Doesn't require surgery, but it's gonna be he's gonna be out for at least three months. So is that is that basically City's? Is that basically what Liverpool needs to win the win the Prem? Oh! 
Bro, what the hell, man? Burundi mysticism that he just pulled. Oh Come on! Lionel and Missy! Uh, three points! Three points, we need the win too. God damn it, come on boys, let's go. 45th minute. Literally moments after some Burundi tribal mysticism that he placed on his two center backs. They literally, literally collide. gone into the second half with more momentum 2-1 we had a couple chances there with a missy uh with Lionel Missy I feel like we probably could have ourselves a total of nine points he hit the post and then also there was an opportunity where he probably could have finessed it but he doesn't have anywhere near the stats to be able to convincingly uh finish those but we've got a match and a half worth of play and I feel like we need to get uh we need to get Omar Osuma involved a little bit more if we're gonna have any success to the he, I'm not gonna lie, he feels like the most sluggish player. He's the highest rated player we've used, but he feels like the most sluggish player we've used so far. Cedric Amissi, am I right? Cedric! I'm giving you every opportunity to represent Burundi! And, and make your Wikipedia page a little bit more flavorful, dude. There's nothing on your Wikipedia page. You've got one sentence, and it literally just says that you were born in Burundi. It doesn't even say the city. It just says you were born in Burundi. That was maybe one of the most underwhelming performances that we've had in Best of the Rest so far. A uh, Missy lives up to his name. Literally missed pretty much every... How does he get 8.7? He doesn't get Man of the Match. Uh, Chicharito gets Man of the Match. How does he get an 8.7? So we've got, uh... We've got ourselves three points... A whopping three points after the first match. Eight shots, four on target. All four of those shots, I think, were misses from a missy. Um, God damn it, dude. I was, you know, I was expecting the Del Real Jami League. I was expecting because the squad's really fun. We've got ourselves Omar Alsuma. I was expecting a little bit more. But Jesus, bro. He's really as bad as advertised. Fusi 2 plays in the Del Real Jami League. Match number two and this guy spent literally three minutes making changes. 83 rating, 90, uh, 96 chemistry. Coming up against a full... Byron side with the exception of Bender, uh, center back Bender. He's got himself Julian Laxler, and then also he's got that 90 Awara. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. He's got an emo manager. <laughs> okay, so I thought that maybe our Sri Lankan player was the worst player in FIFA history. I think. I, I think that a missy just might take the cake. Come on! What a strike! Finally! Lionel Amissi, we're up to six points. If this stands, we would get seven. And then if he holds man of the match, that would be nine. We need way more than that. We need 24 points to tie. Uh, 24 uh, points to tie Afghanistan. I don't know if that's gonna happen. We should get one point if he misses like 15 chances. Amrabat. Jordan Amrabat, send it in. A miss, you gotta make that, and he does 2 0. We are up to, I believe, so we've got three goals with him. Uh, we've got nine, we've got, uh, we've got the win, so that's at least 10, and then maybe man of the match, which would see him get 12. <sighs> Is that it? Did we just need to light a little bit of a fire underneath him? Oh, 
Jesus. All right, I think we're up to, I think we're up to maybe 11 or 12 misses. So we're getting close to that one point we get for the 15th. Uh, we're hovering around 11 or 12 points right now. I'm pretty sure Cedric Amissi, we're going to need the biggest second half. We're going to need Omar Osuma. We're going to need all the Dariel Jamil League boys to step it up. If we're to have any chance to maybe even crack top three. Huh? All right, boys, kid, what's happening? Hello, then. Hey, get here, you fucking wanker. Hey, do that again, right? And I'll get your dog, stick it in a can, and drink the fucker. Wait a minute, who the fuck are you talking to, you little? Oh, yo. <laughs> what have you hands, eh? You think I'd be a serious? Oh, you fucking Wait a minute, I'll fucking smash you, you little. Hey, you fucking. You, let's have it. Let me fucking talk about <laughs> You fucking Can't soft you. cunt. Ah! <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Get off me leg, you fucking uh, gay prick. Now, if he gets a rage mean? quit here in the 65th minute, that's an, an additional plus two, but we've got enough time in the game that I kind of don't want to do that. Okay, so we've got Elton. He's going to pass it off. Where's the Missy? Is that a Missy right there? No, that's all Harvey. Never mind. Come on, boys. I think we're up to, I think we're up to maybe 15 or 16. Okay, 3-1. Oh, we've got 15 minutes left. And there's... Another miss. Oh my god, what is actually going on right now? He's hit the crossbar, he's hit the crossbar, he's hit the post. Here we go. One more. Come on, don't miss it! And there we go! 4-1! Was that off? And it was off. Oh my god! Cedric Amissi, I'm sorry man. Burundi, I, I feel like I let you down even though I feel, dude. His finishing isn't that bad, dude. He's literally got the same finishing as Salazar, and we're burying him left, right, and center. Center Kamisi, like I said, the most appropriate name for any player that I think we've used in Best of the Rest. We were going into this one with, I believe, uh, I believe three points. We get the, so we get nine, three. Uh, he does get, so nine, three. So the, the one goal that we had in match number one, that's 12. Uh, we get the loss. We get a man of the match, which is two. We get a win, which is 15. Did he get any assists? No assists. 15, so I think we're sitting at 15 points with Cedric Amissi, which is good for, I believe, three or four on the table. We're about to find out right now. But Cedric Amissi, a very, very underwhelming performance. And I suppose the most famous thing that Burundi is going to continue to be known for is that Kevin De Bruyne could possibly be uh, a player that could play for Burundi. So as we see here, uh, four goals. So that, like I said, that's 12. Uh, the one win, which is 13. The man of the match, which is 15. So we are good for 15 points with Cedric Amissi. That is episode number seven of Best of the Rest. If you guys want to see another one soon, make sure to hit that like button if you guys did enjoy. And as well, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Hopefully, like I said, you guys are enjoying Best of the Rest Burundi, which I'm going to represent a little bit more. But alas, I suppose it was not meant to be. That is going to do it for episode number 7 of Best of the Rest. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, boys. Juice. Later. Adieu.